Good evening and welcome back to The Guardian TV. Here's what to expect in tomorrow's headlines being the 24th of July 2024. This is tomorrow's news today. We begin with our national stories. The Senate passes minimum wage bill in record time. There's no need for protest. Tinubu pleads with youth. Onye Wuchi, Labour Party Senator, defect to APC or Progressives Congress. Kogi House of Representatives member Act Idris dumps African Democratic Congress ADC for All Progressives Congress APC. We'll resist those who want to burn down Nigeria, says Tinumbu's aide. Amodu Bello University Teaching Hospital, Abuth Doctors, suspends strike after management's pledge to meet demands. We didn't sell Falomo Barracks land. Vacation notice is meant for renovation, says the police. In our business stories, destroying Dangote is bad for Nigeria, AFDB, African Development Bank President Adesino says. Niger State receives 200 tractors to boost farming. The price of tomatoes increased by 55% between May and June. House of Representatives passed a bill seeking to raise 2024 budget by 6.2 trillion naira. Kiari replies Dangote and says he doesn't own blending plants in Malta. In our tech news, Elon Musk opens up on struggle with child's gender transition and says, My son is dead. Village Capital invests $850,000 in two African ag tech startups. The United States bank Mercury is to close accounts of startups in 13 African countries after internal compliance changes. In our entertainment news, DJ Kopi loses her maternal grandmom. I meant she shouldn't shout. God's will Akpabu apologizes to Natasha Akpoti over nightclub remark. In our international headlines, the United States Secret Service Director resigns after Trump assassination attempt. 157 bodies have been recovered after landslides hit Ethiopia. Nigeria and Canada are in talks over direct flight routes and aviation sector collaboration. Finally, in our sports stories, four Nigerian young stars sign scholarship deals with Arsenal. Andy Murray is to retire as he says Paris Olympics is his last ever tennis tournament. For more details of the news and more interesting reports, do visit our website at guardian.ng or pick up a copy of our newspaper from your closest newsstand. Remember to follow us on all social media platforms at Guardian Nigeria. I'm Ifunayo Okoli for Guardian TV. Good night.